Um, Alright, hey guys, it's me, Mac. Um, I just wanted to actually start this new thing um, that I actually wanted to do, which is uh, it's called um, Porch Talk, which is basically um, just going to be me sitting out on my front porch um, in front of my house, like this little enclosed area. Actually, I'm going to pick up my camera so y'all can see. Um, it's just like this little enclosed off area. And a barbecue. So, yeah, um, it's just like. Hold up all situated. There you go. Um, so it's just like this little enclosed off area that um, a bunch of my roommates, you know, come out and smoke and just hang out and stuff. So uh, if you see anybody walking through these two windows or anything, yeah. Um, but basically, it's, but basically that's just what it's going to be. Is basically um, porch talk is just going to be me um, sitting around, actually just talking to you guys about something cool that I feel like talking about or whatever. Um, so this one's actually uh, for this porch talk is actually about um, Orange is the New Black, which I had just finished. Um, Yesterday um, came out June 12th, 2015, and um, well, yeah. So let's just let's just jump into it. So um, right off the bat, actually, out of, out of Orange and the New Black, we first see um, people saying that both Rosa and V are dead. Um, whereas when whereas in uh, you know in season two where it left off is uh, it, you know Rosa what uh, you know Rosa ran at, ran over V, and then um, we kind of don't hear anything about that. They're not really specific on whether on what happened to Rosa. They're not. They don't really tell us like how she died or anything. So you, you can kind of speculate either that she died from her cancer or that she, you know, was sh shot up by the cops or, or whatnot. Like nobody really knows exactly what happened to Rosa. Um, but we we do get the the idea. We do get the the fact that she is dead. Um, so yeah, uh, what what exactly happened? I'm trying to remember. Um, you know, pen, you know. Um, Piper and Alex, you know, Alex gets sent back to Litchfield Prison, and uh, which we saw in the last one. Then her probation officer comes by her place and stuff. So, uh, you know, she's sent back to Litchfield. Her and Piper actually get back together, um, which was actually really big. It was really really cool. Um, what else happens? Um, Boo and uh, Pennsylvania are actually becoming friends now. Um, so so is getting, uh, you know, kind of taken into the. Um, the black family and and Litchfield. Um, what else is happening? Um, is it Mendoza? Mendoza, the um, cook chef lady that was uh, Mex the Mexican cook chef lady. Um, she she's, she's having problems with her son, so maybe that's going to come up in later episodes, which will be actually interesting to see because it seems like her son's not exactly bad. He's just kind of been dealt a bad hand with everything. Um, so it'll be interesting to see how that goes and transfers on into uh, into into later uh, seasons. Um, and uh, yeah, um, Nikki gets sent to the to uh, Max, which was which was really crazy. That was insane for me. Um, I'm gonna kind of miss her. I actually like Nikki, so um, you know, maybe they'll bring her back. Um, you know, I don't know. Uh, it'll be interesting to see what they do with that. Um, Red and Healy start getting uh, a little thing going. It seems like a lot of people are kind of having like romantic relationships into everything, which is kind of interesting. Um, uh, so it's going to be interesting to see actually how that uh, plays out and how those relationships work. Um, Bennett runs away. We don't know where the heck he goes. Um, he's gone. He's off the map. And we have no clue where he is. Um, nobody actually knows where he is. If anybody comes through that door, it's going to be really awkward to explain. Oh, well. Um, what else happens? Um, I'm trying to think. Oh, uh, Sophia gets sent to the shoe, which is... Uh, that'll be interesting to see how that plays out. But let me talk about the last episode, because the last episode actually plays into a lot of what I'm going to be talking about here. So the last episode, we see um, that the guards are on strike because um, who don't want them unionized. Um, and so the guards just say, well, screw it, we're not going to do our job, y'all can have fun. Um, and then a bunch of maintenance guys like take down the gates, and people run out and have fun at the lake. Um, it's going to be interesting to see how that plays out. I wonder. I'm trying to, you know, I'm trying to think of how um, the people are going to, because it was everybody in the prison that it was, in essence, everybody in the prison that ran out and um, and ran out and had fun at the lake. Um, so it'll be interesting to see uh, exactly what happens. It'll be interesting to see. Um, oh, Crazy Eyes is getting a little bit of a of a of a romantic interest, which will be interesting to see again. Um, so yeah, I'm kind of curious as to what's going to happen with uh, everything that's going on. Piper is getting more and more badass. She's not giving a fuck. Um, you know, uh, in season in season three, she gets like this new 
um, Australian kind of love interest, and uh, you know that love interest is about to get out in a couple days and turns on her and basically like grabs a hold of all her money and says, "I'm sorry, but you know I don't have anything to my name." And so Piper uh, kind of says, "Oh yeah, no, it's fine," and then basically screws her over and gets her sent to Max. So. Um, you know, Piper's getting more and more badass, which is going to kind of be interesting to see. I kind of liked, actually, that actress that played the uh, the Australian girl. I need to find out that girl's name. Because uh, very, very cute, very, very attractive. Um, just right there. Um, so, yeah, I mean, there's a lot of stuff that's going to be happening in Orange is New Black that I'm really curious to see what's going to happen with Sophia. Um, I'm really curious to see what's going to happen with um, Piper and Alex. That's always a relationship that's going to be really, really interesting. I'm really interested to see what's going to happen with this whole, um, you know, because uh, cause in season, cause in season three, like a new company takes over, um, takes over Litchfield, and so it's going to be interesting to see how they um, work with Caputo and how Caputo works with the guards and tries to get everything to, you know, work and, and work well. Um, it's going to be really interesting to see everything like that. Um, and yeah, um, really, really curious. Really, really looking forward to season four. Uh, it's not coming out for a long, long time. Um, but yeah, um, so basically uh, I'm going to be doing uh, things like this more and more often. Um, probably the, I'm going to, I kind of got lazy and just wanted to do this all in like one segment and talk about everything crazy that happened. Um, but with later shows, I think I'm going to do it just episode by episode and um, kind of talk to you guys more about that and kind of meet you guys on a more weekly basis. But uh, that's it for this video, guys. I'll see you all in the next one. And uh, yeah. Bye.